G'day folks, this is Shane and I'm here with Dr. Rick. G'day folks. This is GeekCon 2018 and we're going to show you some of our favourite licks. We'll take it in turns, we'll pick five of our favourite blues, country, whatever licks that we play to death and we'll show you what they are and maybe one day we might actually put a lesson together for some of them. Yeah, some that's point. what they say, the best way to learn a lick is to teach it. So we'll see how we go. <laughs> now do you want to go first or do you want me to? Uh, yeah, you, can, you go first. Alright, well, so I'll think of one. How about we do it in the key of A? Now I showed the Tone King this lick and this is one of my favourite BB King style ones. It goes like this. That's nice. I yeah, like that one. It's got a major sort of vibe to it. Yeah, well in keeping with that. This one's also sort of in A major but with just a couple of funny notes in it too. I don't know what key that's in. But anyway, it's right. A something. Yeah. Here's another one that I do to death. This is in the key of E. I nice. like that one. It works over just about anything. Yeah. Okay. Well, this one's in the key of E something as well. I'm starting to get into the uh, the major feel licks over the straight up minor ones lately, yeah. and this is one I kind of borrowed from a guy called Chris Kane. Yeah. It's, so it's a little bit different on the landing notes. Yeah, too. no, I dig that. Uh, yeah, this one's in the key of I think I'll do in G minor, cool. just for something a bit bit different. Okay. Man, that's tasty. Where'd you pull that one from? You don't want to know. <laughs> Alright, I'll go in a G minor one as well. This is a, a sort of one I use without a pick or do without a pick. So. Oh, it's that one. Yeah. There's a slight variation on it that I play to death as well. I'll show you this. Mm. You played it to death? I don't think I've ever heard him play that one. It's on an album. Oh, is it? Oh, okay. Yeah, well, once, there so. you go. Yeah. No one's heard it though, so. Okay. Well, this is a, 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 in A as well. It's, it's a series of pull offs, and uh, the scholars out there, the musical theorists, uh, if you will, will know what key this one's in. It's, it's a thing that you would play over A. Yeah, that's kind of fancy, mate. Yeah. So you're a blues guy, what's going on? Uh, blues is boring. No, it's not, it's great, we love it. <laughs> in the boring, in the blues, sorry. Yeah. <laughs> so this is one I, I got from some country lesson on YouTube. So this is a good one. If I find it, I'll link it in the cards. <laughs> It sounds a bit Brad Paisley. I think it is a Brad Paisley. Yeah. I, let, let's start. I might have butchered the end, but I think that's one of yeah, his. Yeah, yeah, I like it could it. be. The pull offs be. are really good. Uh, okay. Gosh. Go it's funny, more. you know. Yeah, I'm sure I do. If I'm <laughs> yeah. Well, I guess in the um, sort of theme of uh, country pull off things, he's uh, one in E. Sorry for that rude note at the end. I just thought of something cool we could throw in as well. Rick and I used to play in bands together for years and we still jam and all that kind of stuff together. And we, we do a lot of harmony stuff, which is good fun too. So I usually do the really easy part and then I leave the complicated part to this guy. Yeah. So uh, we used to play this one in A. So then what we do over that is Rick would play, what are you actually doing to this with this harmony? Is it a specific one or is it just something you pulled out? Oh yeah, well I can I do a third below or a third above. Maybe I'll start with a third below. Okay, yeah. so we'll go okay. one, two, three. One, two, three.
just adds a really nice flavor. You know, if you're playing it in a band with another guitar player and you've got that sort of improv section, we've, we've got a whole lot of those yeah. little tricks that we used to play. And, uh, Do you remember the other one? Yeah, I remember the other ones. Yeah, you give it a rip to um, So it was like a... One, two, three, four. Call this video Shane and Rick's top five cliche licks. Yeah, or something right. like that. Yeah. What do you reckon? Top five, top five sort of grab bag to reach for when you can't think of anything else. <laughs> yeah, I think that's good. Cool. All right, thanks for watching, guys. This video was something completely random and different, but we thought we'd share a little bit of our small bag of tricks, and at least in my case, and pick your brain a little bit with some of your favorites as well. Thanks for watching. Get you soon. Cheers. <laughs>